Strike rate only 161. A low average. And I think he'll probably block one delivery, and that'll be his first one. What's he going to ball, Stuart Broad? Full, straight. It's high in the air. Field is going back desperately. He's safe. Smacked it way up into the air of Freedy. Hat trick ball. Who cares? Freedy likes it full to get on that drive. That's where England have tested him out with a short ball, but he's got such a quick hand. Fast bat. Outrageous shot again down the ground. Nowhere near the middle of the bat. Complete miss hit straight down the ground before somewhere near the splice. Just power, sheer power. Just the pace of his hands through the ball. What are his plans? Yorkers with the odd bouncer. Bouncer, yes. And it's a wide. The problem with the short ball in the first six overs is that you've only got two men out and a short ball can go from third man all the way round to deep mid-wicket. And if you get it slightly wrong, it could go over cover point. Well, he can take it on that short ball, looking at this field with the leg slip, and then there's no one else in view until square leg in front of square. Taking him on with this shorter ball. Crashes it away through mid-wicket. Stand and deliver a 3D. He ain't running. Everyone's watching. Pakistan supporters have crowded in here just to watch Boom Boom and he's not disappointing. Length ball, he stands and admires, he's hoiked it over mid-wicket for four. Three balls, ten runs. Field change. Sure. Well, that's the plan. Gives himself room again, outside leg stump, doesn't get all of that, but still gets a boundary four. Five overs have been bowled, 45 for two. Wide of the crease, full of length. They'll know each other from Leicester days. Afridi had a spell at Leicester. Stuart Broad's county is Leicester. Thinking something different, get wide of the crease, get your Yorker in. That delivery shows that he's going to go Yorkers. Will he change his pace? Will he change his length? Farmed away through mid wicket, over mid on. Another boundary. Slower ball. He hasn't middled one yet, Afridi, and he's got 18 off seven. Slower ball. He had to wait, wait, right off the toe of the bat. And with those fast hands and his power, he gets it over mid wicket. Nowhere near the middle again. Another, and you think you can safely say he's got all of that one? Thank you. Yes, 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 he has middle one now. That was it. And this ground is not big enough if he hits them like that. There aren't many grounds big enough. That was right out the screws. That has gone a long, long way. And he knows it. Well, what an eye. Out of the ground. That's gone. Wide of the crease. Smeared over the offside again. Hasn't gone for six, has gone for four. End of the fielding restrictions. It's 66. There he goes, it's high in the air. There's a fielder under it. One too many. Oh, what a catch! He lost it, Michael Yordi. It was way into the air. He'd no right to catch this. It's a magnificent effort. What a catch. What a wicket to get. He wasn't going to die wondering, Afridi. First delivery face from Dalrymple. Nowhere near it again. It went a mile up in the air. The wind was swirling around. Yardy gets too close, dives backwards. And does brilliantly to keep it in his hands. What a catch. The spin twins, Yardy and Dalrymple. What a combination.
Well, it's a stunning catch, is this? He got too close to it, a freedom. Entertaining again. Sent in to do a job, and he's done it. 28, 67.